Good morning, friends. Today's meditation is from the book of James, chapter 3, verse 6. I'm just going to read a single sentence from that verse. And it says, the tongue is a fire. So the word for today is fire. Now, I've been thinking, what does it mean for the tongue to be a fire? And then I investigated into what truly a fire is. A fire is a product of a chemical reaction. You know, if you investigate, you will discover that, you know, combustion is a form of oxidation. That means that a substance gains oxygen. So coming back to the Bible, the tongue is a fire. What does it mean? It means that you know, the, our words, they become a fuel and our feelings are the oxygen. So when we load our words with the energy of our feelings, you know, when certain situations, circumstances ignite, you know, the combustion inside of our hearts, then it produces fire, a fire that destroys a fire that is not positive. It's not the fire that brings light, it's a fire that is meant to bring destruction and poverty in your life. So for that very reason, it is so important to change direction. And instead, we can use as fuel the Word of God. We can use as oxygen, oxygen the Holy Spirit. And also, we can use our faith as that ignition element for starting a new form of oxidation, a new exchange of energy, of powerful divine energy. Because when the power of, of, of the Holy Spirit comes in the Word of God, you know, it creates a new reaction, and the new fire that comes into your life is a fire that produces light, produces change, a positive outcome. So today, let our tongue be set on fire but not with the fire that comes from the world, that comes from hell. Let our tongue be set on fire in the, with the fuel of the Word of God, with the oxygen, with the blowing wind of the Holy Spirit, and with the sparkle of our faith. God bless you.